Hey, a pleasant good day, everybody. This is Sports Night News. I'm Joe Bork, and this is going to be a quick video on the Chicago White Sox making two good moves, adding a guy that has the potential to be their second baseman next year, and Josh Harrison, who was good for the A's last year, as well as the Nationals, and then also Joe Kelly, who has been one of the more premier relief pitchers in baseball um, for most of his career. He's had some down seasons with control problems, but other than that, he's been very consistent, has one of the most sickest curveballs in all of baseball, and a great fastball at that as well. Uh, Kelly mixed in with the curveball fastball, does also throw a sinker and a changeup that are also very solid pitches. He actually throws the sinker at 33.8%. That's his money pitch if he needs a double play, and we've seen him get that multitudes of times as well. He's kind of underrated being able to mix that in to get the ground balls when he needs it instead of the strikeout. But that is what it is. And then he also has a very good changeup. Uh, these are two great moves, um, in my eyes, for the Chicago White Sox to get Joe Kelly for two years because, again, he's one of the better relief pitchers in baseball. I don't see one of my Philadelphia Phillies again, so congratulations to you guys for getting Joe Kelly. We got um, we got Familia instead. But um, Joe Kelly to me, he's one of the most exciting pitchers in baseball, too, not just because of what he can do on the mound, but the energy and fire he brings. He's like a hockey player in baseball with the energy and fight he brings and punch and jam to a game every night. I mean, imagine your team being down 3-1 in kind of a dull game in the 8th or ninth inning, and Joe Kelly comes and punches out the side and gets pumped up, almost knocks over your catcher, celebrating or something like that, some crap like that. Like, he's a guy that just brings that energy that is going to really just kind of spread throughout the clubhouse, which the White Sox have a lot of players like that. Um, when it comes to the Tim Anderson of the world, the Eloy Jimenez of the world, that really do, Lucas Giolito even, that are very good vibing energy guys. <clears throat> that always bring the right clubhouse energy. And obviously, Tony Lusa proved people wrong last year, at least not necessarily with what he said, but at least in how the team produced with him as the manager. He still kind of had a bunch of stupid quotes, but that is what it is. But all in all, this team is set up to be a very good top contender this year to potentially get to the end. And adding Joe Kelly and adding Josh Harrison are just going to help them with that. Is Josh Harrison, at the very least, once you were able to maybe add more infield help, to the Chicago White Sox at either the trade deadline next year or whenever they do that, maybe even in this offseason. Um, he's a guy, at the very least, is a great platoon guy, bench bat, but also can still probably start for a season for you at second base, and I think that might be what they're envisioning going in, but we'll have to see for the Chicago White Sox. All in all, though, in conclusion, great signings by them, definitely A signings for them as they got Joe Kelly, a guy that's not only a great pitcher, but a great energizer guy, and honestly, a guy that I think is a perfect guy to have on a team. He doesn't get enough credit for being a great team player just because of the energy he brings. Sometimes, yes, he does say stupid stuff and do stupid stuff and get carried away, but that energy that a guy can bring spreads and is contagious, and you kind of want to run through a brick wall for guys like that, at least in my opinion, so I think he's a perfect fit with the Chicago Rice. Uh, they have a team that's very fun to watch. Um, that really brings that fun uh, energy to baseball, the new school kind of let the kids play energy to baseball, and I love that. So peace out, everybody. Stay safe. This has been the latest edition of the Sports Night News Baseball Shows. We talked about Josh Harrison and Joe Kelly going to the Shy Sox.